Nobody knew about his role on Empire. He was a, basically an actor. He had a role, a recurring role on Empire, uh, but nobody knew him. He wasn't an A-list actor by any means. And what better way to climb your way to the A-list than to be a victim? So we're not going to say that you're such a good actor that you're going to be recognized like you're Denzel Washington based on your actual merit. Instead, you can climb very quickly by just saying that you're a victim of the most absurd hate crime that we've ever heard of and that couldn't plausibly have happened, right? Yep. And so this is what he did, and he wasn't the only one. He he did it perhaps the most gloriously, but let's not forget that there was an epidemic of fake hate crime hoaxes that were happening all across university That's campuses. Right. People calling themselves the N word, writing the N word on their cars, and and it was eventually discovered. And the, these people were basically just given a, a little slap on the wrist because who would want to challenge this in the middle of you know BLM race rhetoric? And That's that right. shouldn't have been happening. People should have been expelled, and Jesse Smollett should have spent hard time in prison.